So we're painting! Starting off with like a clear bowl. Um, this is Shay's one. Which is so cool actually. Um, I'll show you once I'm done. I told you I'm not here to mess around And you've been acting too mysterious You didn't think I'd go but do you know? Extracting protein. Uh, I just need to quickly add some of this to the buffer. We add this specific solution last because um, it degrades pretty quickly. So you want to add it at the very end when you're about to use your stuff. I'm going to put this back in the freezer. So <laughs> that didn't happen. So in here, I have my cells, um, and they're currently in PBS, so I'm just going to put the buffer on them. Dead. Your hair, your look, your everything When I 
Today we're doing like a little dinner cooking thing in our house and today's my turn and it's gonna be so fascinating because I've never made this recipe before like if you're Zonga you know what the hobby is um, so that's what I'm gonna try to make today um, and I'm gonna bring you guys along for the journey I'm gonna make it with beef stew on the side because I feel like there always needs to be some sort of meat with black people um so for my menu i'm just making like cocktails mocktails so passion fruit and lemonade you know classic south african things and then i am making like the samp and whatever like the whole bit and then for dessert i got these little cake popsicles they're like cookie dough brownie cake sickles from woolies because I was gonna bake but then when I put together the baking ingredients it was already adding up to like 600 rand and I don't even have like a baking tray piping bags all of that stuff like I was gonna make cupcakes and it was just too much so I was like okay let's just keep it simple and just buy dessert so that's the plan and I'm gonna show you how it goes let's go so first order of business I'm gonna add that so weak what the hell ah. maybe i should have gotten scissors <sighs> anywho i bought these online because i couldn't find them <laughs> why am i weak oh okay there we go um <clears throat> i called my mom and she said i should do two cups of the sam and one cup of the ground nuts I honestly don't know if this is gonna be enough because there are like six, six people that I'm cooking for. So, okay, I'm gonna do like one and a half of these and two and a half of the Sam. I think that would be enough to feed people. I don't want them to starve. Okay, so that the Sam. just realized that I really have like scorny arms like I am so weak Ugh. let's stop going to the gym please. wow I don't even know if this pot is gonna be big enough um, I'm just measuring right now but I'm gonna wash everything obviously like you don't know where the sand has been <coughs> Well, this looks like a lot. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, so that's that. I'm just gonna wash everything and then put it on the stove to cook. It should take hours. My mom says it's gonna take long, so that's why I'm starting now at two o'clock. I'm serving dinner at seven, hopefully. As part of the recipe, I have to have like powdered peanuts. But then I don't have like those fancy powdery things, you know, like that thing where you just <laughs> have and then you have to grind the peanuts in there. So I'm going to use like the grinder portion of my blender and I hope that that works. <laughs> this is going to be so entertaining actually. Um, but yeah, let's let's grind up some peanuts. <coughs> I think I'm gonna do two cups. I don't know. I really don't know how much I'm supposed to do. I've never made this recipe before, so this is gonna be, wow. 
So I have like the regular jug and it has like these nice four things. And then this is the grinder attachment for coffee and it only has two. So I think I'm going to use the jug because it makes more sense. <sighs> So the samp and the beans are almost done. It's not even beans. I don't know why I keep saying samp and beans, but that's almost done. So I'm going to get started on the beef stew. It's currently 4.30. So it's been about like two and a half hours since I started cooking. Ugh, onion, damn, why, why is everything fighting with me today? Ugh, probably going to cry because of these onions as well. Um, but this is so random. Do any of you guys watch true crime while you're cooking? Or is it just me? Am I crazy? Am I weird for <laughs> doing this? Because there's something so therapeutic about watching true crime while you're cooking. I love it so much. I can't get enough of it, honestly. Um, <clears throat> this onion is so tiny. <sighs> Yeah, I'm gonna need another onion. This is so small. Anywho, I'm gonna get back to cooking and I'll show you guys as I go along. Um, I'm gonna continue watching some true crime while I cook because it's so flippin' therapeutic. I don't know what it is. It's just, it's so therapeutic. because I don't want to put too much for y'all and then you leave it and then it's just going to be hard on the plate so we don't want that we don't want food waste we don't advocate for waste in this household and also guys it looks purple and I swear to god it's not supposed to look purple oh my god you know what you're doing it's not supposed to look purple is that purple your favorite color yes I know but also if it's not ready guys I'm sorry it's not it's not me. I'm sorry. No, if you get sick, sick, I'm no, sorry. Don't no, volunteer for this. Where's my leg? 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 Where's
to stop. Hopefully, I'll be feeling better tomorrow. <laughs> just got back from the lab and oh it was such a disaster like I was so like keen to just get there get things done like I really was looking forward to it I had like a list of things that I wanted to do had all my protocols written down and the first thing literally took forever I started at 12 and I think I only finished at like three um, but like it didn't even work out so I I don't know how to explain it but I'm just gonna simplify it so I had like a a tray full of samples and I had 32 samples on there and as I was like walking to take the readings from the samples I tripped and everything fell over and most of the stuff like spilled so now I couldn't even use that information so I had to like throw everything away and like restart but I decided not to restart because it was already like almost three o'clock so I was like nah I'm not gonna do that so I decided to take a quick break and I was like okay let me just take a quick little break and eat something and then i'll go back to like do the other stuff that i had planned but i just feel so discouraged like that whole thing just threw me off um and it just ugh. i'm actually like really really tired right now and i feel like I just put in effort and nothing comes out of the effort and I don't think I want to do this anymore like I'm actually so tired <sighs> it's four o'clock right now um, I'm gonna lie on my bed for the next two ish hours I'm gonna get up at six to have dinner and then um around seven i'm gonna start with other work because i do have a lot of work to do um i'm also supposed to present at a conference in like two weeks so i need to work on that as well <sighs> i honestly just feel so drained like i feel drained um yeah yeah, I decided that I'm gonna do the stuff like I'm gonna redo today's um, stuff tomorrow like tomorrow morning before my other practical so I have um, I have to tutor second year students tomorrow but thankfully it's their last session um, and yeah my I also had my last session with third years and I didn't sign up for other practicals thankfully so I just have like two more pracs to go and then I'm done. <sighs> Guys, I just feel so tired. I don't even know what to do anymore. Like, ugh, I feel tired, overwhelmed. I feel like I'm not working enough. Like, I just want to be done with this degree actually. <sighs> anyway, and, um, I, didn't, I didn't see them on the... Kinsey's car's overheating, oh, guys. I didn't see them downstairs. Oh, shit. Hello, hello. You're in charge of... You know, most of the times I'd be busy saying, like, men are useless and stuff. It's not useless. It's not useless. I know. I don't know shit. If this you happened know, to me, I'd have been like... You went... Ah, <laughs> well... <laughs> you went there, though. Shit. He opened the boot for us. And then he just he looked just, at us. He said, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's like, like yeah, you guys, pack. you guys can consort this. You guys can Are you serious? consort this. Out. Isn't that like a guy thing? Yeah. 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 Gonna to the shit. Are you yeah. serious? Yes. He was like, you guys can sort it out. And I was like, oh, is there space in the boot for like the bottles of water? And it's like, I don't, I wouldn't know. Exactly. Yeah, he didn't pack the boot. He didn't pack the damn boot. We spoiled him from the get-go. So he was just watching. 
No. no he, he said uh, you guys can uh, sort the this stu- out his and stuff. then he was going to like take his stuff to Yeah. Him. So he just cleared his yeah. stuff uh-uh, and then put left. Put stuff on the floor. Put oh. these bags on the floor. We're in the middle of the road. Check. But let me just quickly sort out the, the towing guy just got here. The towing guy just got here. I'll call you in a bit. Yeah. I don't know what that's for, but it's kind of scary. Oh my freaking gosh, I'm leaving. I'm literally driving off. Oh my gosh. Oh, here. There's his cup power coming up. Find me at a club Cause if I ever tried to cut a rug By the time the night is done You will know that I'm a strange one I don't ever know what to do How to find a beat, how to groove But I dream about finding you You make me wanna sway And you'd say Dance with me I don't care about where or when Pick a song that never ends Dance with me Close your eyes, just move your body If you only knew what it's like To feel like you have all eyes On every little move you make You can't seem to find your way Maybe all this time I'm blind Maybe I just never try Why? Somebody didn't bring black um, oh, jackets. We are People didn't bring jackets, and the bridge is swinging back in place. Yeah, it's me and the problem. You and Kenzie. <laughs> 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 
it's move out day for these two clowns over there. Oh. And then out you're carrying boxes. It's move out day. Oh. Except for you, Shay, where are you going? Nowhere. And then the queen over here. Hi. <laughs> Oh, it's 40 yeah. rand. Yeah, I've had it before. I've had it before. Someone bought it for me. I swear I didn't just call you. No, I didn't. I love with clowns. Yeah. Just enjoying our festive drinks. That's did going on YouTube. Did you catch on catch on the phone? Yeah. Oh. GBL. Exactly. Wait, what is GBL? Thank you. It's on here. What's GBL? Gerbil. No, gingerbread latte. Yeah.